Hello guys, in this video we will see how to install and configure exam 8.2 on Debian 12 operating systems. But the process is same on all Debian operating systems. Okay, so first open any web browser, then go to Apache friends dot org. Hit enter. See here, we have the jam for Linux and version number is 8.2.12. Also see here, jam is the most popular PHP development environment. environment. Zamp is completely free, easy to install Apache distribution containing MariaDB or MySQL, PHP and Paul. And it is easy to install and use. Okay. So we have to click on Zamp for Linux. Go to this page. Wait, it is going to download. See, download has been started and its size is 153 megabytes. Wait until download completes. Okay, download is completed. Now open terminal. Go to downloads directory. LS. See here we have the LS again. See, we have the XAM Linux 8.2.12 installer.run file. Okay, now we have to execute this run file. Try to just give XAMPP file, copy it. It won't work, just I want to show you the C permission in it. Even if you give sudo, C, we are unable to install. Okay, so we have to grant the permissions for this run file. sudo chmod set. Then give the XAM run file name. Now run the dot forward slash dot forward slash give the XAM. See, now we are able to run. See, we can't run without super user. So we have to give sudo and hit it. Click on forward. See, by default it has selected core files. And if you want to install XAMPP developer files, you have to select the checkbox. We can't uncheck or check this one. Okay, only you can check this XAMPP developer files. I'm going, I want to install both. So click on forward. You see, this is the installation directory. That is slash opt lamp. Okay, click on forward. Ready to install. So click on forward to start the installation of Zampan Debian. See, installation has been started. It may take 5 to 10 minutes. See, setup has finished installing Zamp on your computer. Okay, so keep the checkbox. That is XAMPP to launch the XAMPP application. So keep it as it is and click on finish. See installation has been completed successfully. So remove the XAMPP file. XAMPP RM. Okay. Hit enter. Let's see. We have cleared the space. Now go to here. Then click on manage servers. See all the like MySQL database. Pro FTPD and Apache Web Server all are stopped. So click on start. Also start the MySQL database. The port may be used by some other one. So give the port number some other one. In your case it won't happen. So click on OK. Now click on start. See if Apache Server won't start. We can't do anything. See, now after changing port number, here it worked. In your case, it worked without changing port number. Okay. See, now also start this Pro FTBD. Pro FTBD. 
see now all three servers are started now go to new tab then give localhost in your case just give localhost and hit enter okay but in my case i have to give localhost and port number 81 because i have configured hit enter see if we receive this dashboard which means we have successfully installed xamp on debian linux see we have installed 8.2.12 even if you go to package see here the version xamp 8.2.12 now click on php my admin see these are the list of the databases want to create new database you have to click on new then provide the database then click on then you have to select the collection settings and click on create see new database is there you can also create database by going to sqlr query click on query then run the query create database test db select it and click on submit query still see here we are unable to see so click on refresh see new database test db is there now if you want to verify the version of the mysql or mariadb just give select version put semicolon then click on submit query see here we have installed mariadb 10.4.3 if you want to go back to home remove this one and hit enter okay now we will create the sample php file so go to terminal xamp is installed on slash opt and lamp okay so go to that path cd opt lamp tenter ls go to ht docs see here we have the ht docs okay so go to the directory ls see here we have the index and index.php and all okay so create a php file sudo vi control hello world dot php hit enter plus i to insert mode then give the php tags echo put semicolon after each statement after end of the each statement then echo sum of two numbers close the php tag save the file double q exclamation hit enter now go to here and remove this dashboard after forward slash in your case just give the php file name hello world whatever the name that you have given to the page file hit enter see we got the output but output is in single line but here we have defined in two lines so we have to give the break tag okay shift a echo double quotations we are put semicolon save the file exclaim escape exclamation wq exclamation hit enter now reload the page see now the output is in two lines the last option that i am going to show you is we will see how what will happen if you stop the apache server stop the apache web server select it and click on stop now reload see it is stopped now reload the page see unable to connect then click on start then click on reload see it is starting and we are able to connect see if you want to open this suppose if you close this one and if you want to open again we have to go to the path simply go to home directory and i will show you how to navigate cd opt opt ls go to lamp ls see here we have the 
manager dot linux dot manager hyphen linux hyphen x64 run file okay if you open this file then we will open the sam control panel okay so we have to give sudo just copy this one paste it hit enter so it is not found so we have to give like dot forward slash hit enter see we got the exam control panel go to manage servers see here we have the options okay so in this video we have seen how to install and configure exam 8.2 on debian operating systems for more exam or apache tutorials please subscribe my channel